All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to do the Ursa challenge and we have four fights left as usual. And I'm thinking of using this team. So you can see we have a little bit lower of enemy power and this is like a boss fight. So it's going to be two waves and they might be too strong. But look at this. We got Kings of Jam. We got Camo. We got some bleeds from Bizarro. So we should be able to debuff them like crazy. But yeah, man, let's see, we're fighting seven reds and we got three green, so that's good. Maybe we lose King Sejam because like he's going to be at disadvantage. But let's see. Um, I'm thinking of stunning someone, but I'm actually going to taunt and get some healing. I want him to, to get hit and then just give him some shield. And here, let's just use this. Maybe use the basic as well after. Yep. Okay, good. Speed them down. We actually get some music here. And then let's just debuff them. Have the Embar strength ups. Alright, he's tanky. I like it. Let's use this. Weaken them. Nice. There goes one. I'm going to save the stun for next wave. Uh, I don't need to bleed them anymore, I think. I right, save the stun as well. Okay, so now we're going to be fighting Connor. Hopefully he's not too bad. Okay, he's going to bleed out. Right. So let's start with his speed downs. And then I want to stun Connor. Give Bizarro the strength ups. Go for this. Hopefully do the basic. We did. Nice. On him too. Some more debuffs. And then even more debuffs. It's actually a good team, man. Wow. They are doing great work. And let's just stun this guy, I guess. That's a good team. I like it. I really like it. They are taking down. My King's Jam is overhealed as well. I like that. Okay, nice. That's a good team. Might might get us through the whole challenge. The next three fights. I like it. Look at this. They didn't even touch us. We're overhealed and everything. We have two stuns on our team. We have speed down with camo and then a bunch of debuffs. I like this team. Okay, let's go. Next wave. We're fighting 13 reds. Now this gonna have five waves, but they're not gonna be as tanky or strong. Let's see. Let's start with the debuffs. So that we have the cooldown after. Let's heal this guy. Let's do the AoE. And then let's just do this and get rid of them with the bleeds, I guess. It's gonna take so much damage. Okay, so okay, there we go. He's out. It's good. If they if they hit like Bizarro, it's fine because he can heal. So yeah. Or even Camel. But Camel is not that tanky. Not too geared. Let me overheal, just in just in case, right? Oh, that was good damage. Get rid of this guy. And then let's just kill him fast because they're they're not. I don't think we have a problem here. It's gonna be pretty easy. Again, the boss fights are the hardest ones, which is like less waves but more tanky and a lot more more stronger. So. We should be able to do this. And we even have lower team power. So yeah, it's it's working great. Debuffs are very good. Let's heal our guy again. Since he's going to be taunting. Nice. Okay. I think the good thing here is that we're fighting a lot of reds. And then our taunter is in green. So that's very good. We got to be careful of those AoEs though. Right? <laughs> now should have overhealed there. Oh, we're still taunting. I think he's taunting. He's constantly taunting because, like, at the, I think at the end of his turn, he's taunting. So there's no way they're, they're going to attack anyone else. Unless they have AoEs. But even King Sajam, he's doing a lot of work. I like it. Oh, look at those debuffs, man. Oh, dude, they're going to tick down like crazy. I think they're going to die. Literally everyone. There goes one. There goes one. There goes one, and there goes the other. Nice, <laughs> okay. Stun. Speed down, just in case. Let's heal. There we go. 
Let's go ahead and do the guaranteed stun. I like how Bizarro has a guaranteed stun now, too. It's nice. Bleeds. If they would apply some debuffs on Bizarro, too, that would be even greater. <laughs> That's working great, though. Nice. So, on to the second to the last fight. Let's see what we got. That's pretty easy so far. I like it. Look at this. We're using 19,000. Oh, that's that's actually kind of like a... Hmm. Boss fight. Because, like, it's a previous from the last one. So, 26k and power. I think it's going to be, like, three waves here. I don't think it's going to be five, is it? It might be five, too. But, yeah, it's five. Okay. But we are going to be fighting a boss. So, Connor. So, it's almost like a boss fight. Let's go ahead and throw the AoEs at the start so we can take them down. Nice. Okay, Bizarro is taking some damage. Oh, no. Oh, don't kill Bizarro. Oh, we lost Camo. I should have over overhealed Bizarro. That, that was my mistake. So, I think we should be fine, though, because, like, look at this. John is below 50, so he's going to give so many strength ups and power strength ups. We should be fine. Let's give that to him, actually. It's going to have so much damage. We could throw an AoE too, but I think we... Yeah, we used it. Let's kill this guy. 72k. 72k from John. Not even gear 10, right? Gear 11. <laughs> 111. Dude. He can be below 50. He's great. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I wanna use an AoE and see if he kills everyone. Let's go. We lost Bizarro. But look at the damage there. And look at the Empowered Strength Ups here. Holy. 87k? Man, we lost a lot of characters, but... Did you see that? Holy. Okay, there's the boss fights here. I'm gonna give that to John. Stunt Connor. Maybe I should have stunned... The oh, no. Okay, that's gonna be a rough one. Let's see if we can kill Connor. We cannot... But we have death immunity. He stunned us, though. Dang it. If they don't have a purge, actually, I don't think they can kill us. Oh, there goes our death immunity. And he has a purge. Oh, no, guys. There goes one. Ah, that was close. Okay. I'm going to play this a little bit better. Like, I'm going to overheal Bizarro at the start. And then speed them down with Camo. And not start with the bleeds. So they don't have too many turns. But... Yeah, well, that was my mistake. Let's overheal. Maybe I should have stunned someone too. Let me heal Camo just because if they attack him. And then I, I want to stun this guy because he has an AoE. I remember from the last time. Now let's just do this. Speed them down. Maybe get another turn before them. Yep. And then we should be able to stun this guy too. Don't care about the red because we're taunting with greens. Nice. We turned down this guy too because he had disease. Like it. It's pretty good. So now we've, we're out of the first wave with everyone alive. That's nice. Okay. I'm gonna taunt. Just in case. Give the strength ups to like King Sajam. Because he did a lot of damage earlier. That was still decent. Very decent. Let's go ahead and throw this. It's debuffs. Alright. Oh, John. John below 50. Okay, I like it. That's actually better. <laughs> And now they're all gone. <laughs> Dude, John is strong at below 50, man. He's very strong. I like him. He's one of my favorites for challenges because I'm not going to take him to gear 70 because his stats are not the greatest. But in challenges, he's one of my favorites because he helps a lot. Right? So nice. We'll give that to King Sajam. Look at the damage here. Whoa, man. Let's see. Oh, that straight up killed him. Wow. 41k. Oh, man. Okay, this might kill everyone. Dude. And power strength ups like crazy. How do we even get 15,000 strength ups? This, this, is this going to kill the... It did. Okay. Do you see the power strength ups on my team right now? Everyone has so many. Dude. I'm going to kill this guy. 52k, the boss. That's insane. And there goes a red from a blue. Oh, wow, man. Okay, I'm going to let them get John to below 50. 
<laughs> but dude oh superman here okay if they get him below 50 there's no way i'm gonna lose this way <laughs> this is so fun <laughs> i like it man so it's gonna be two waves here so they're probably gonna kill him if they hit him but let's see maybe they have an aoe i'm gonna give the shield to me just in case and then i'm gonna stun who do i stun here i think this guy has an aoe right then let's speed them down I'm gonna stun the other blue. Alright. Let's do some damage. Alright, let's do some even more damage. Okay. Bleeds. And then what are they, what are they gonna do? Okay, let's give them some more bleeds. Nice, okay. Let's target this guy. Hit lower. Um should be fine here. They're gonna have some turns. Not a lot though. Okay, let me overheal again. Let me give the shield to me just in case. I don't want to lose him. Let's just stun him. Why not? Speed them down. We got this under, under control, I think. This first wave, at least. Okay. Good damage there. Is he dead now? Nope. They are tanky. Okay. Gotta kill this red. Ah, he, he's almost dead, but he's gonna die from bleeds, I think. There we go. And then look at the disease as well. They got a bunch. Mm, let me give the shit to Camo. Overheal with Bizarro. They have a lot of debuffs. Okay. He ticked down like crazy. Wow. There is Superman. Okay, I'm actually going to stun this guy. I think the others are just going to taunt, right? The big guys. I'm not going to stun Superman just so that he might attack john actually he doesn't have an aoe so there's no way john gets below 50 here i think so we're just gonna debuff them nice and slow all right oh superman removes them that's right that's right at least he's not even leaders but right okay they're taking down some damage with king nice okay he removes them wow it's crazy let me do some damage on this guy. I want to kill this guy first. Because I think he's got the damage moves. The others are just going to taunt. If they get a turn. Because like Camo is, is pretty good too. Ooh, Bizarro or no. Look at how much health we have. We literally have like 1 HP. Now it's going to give him a part strength up. Because he's below 50. And he's almost dead again. <laughs> okay. Not bad, not bad. me over heal that was good healing actually i like it not too bad decent there goes one speed them down again we got a doom on superman but that doesn't matter he's gonna just purge it um let's just give him give him that since he's gonna get the bar strength ups too some more damage and he's tanky i don't know how we're gonna kill superman because he purges the debuffs right Actually, if we have disease on the others, he takes damage too. Come on. Give him some more disease. Let's stun him. Uh, I'm gonna give that to him again. Some more debuffs. The others should die from the bleeds and stuff. Yeah, they're dead. And Superman purges everything. Just bleed him. So glad he's out of the leader spot. Okay, he's almost dead. He didn't purge this, this time. And one more hit with John. Boom. Oh, John didn't kill him. Let's laser him. Boom. <laughs> nice. So that was a pretty nice challenge, man. We all only died once. Just because I made a mistake. I thought they were going to be weaker, but they were not. <laughs> but that's a pretty easy challenge. Like for the characters that you can use as well. You have for the great ones. Oh, I cannot see. I, I believe... You have like Dark Side. Oh, you definitely have Dark Side. Barda is pretty good. Huntress. And then Jesse, I used. That's what I used for the earlier, earlier levels. But yeah, let's see about the legendary points for Ursa. So let me take her to L1. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you my legendary order for her. So that's a cool skin. I like it. So Ursa is gonna be pretty good. And one of my, like, I think what I would take first, this one, you deal more damage to male enemies, 
and there's a lot of males in this game so increased 50 percent damage is very very good however i don't think i would take this first i would either like i would either take the three or the five so the three can help you if you have her like rebirth and stuff high damage she does heavy damage to a single enemy and then the damage can ignore shield and awareness so that's very good for spectre like very very good but i think what i would take first and what i think i will take first too is this gain permanent stun immunity at the start of the battle and it cannot be purged so i believe it says permanent so it cannot be purged so you're gonna be permanent stun immune right so i think that's very good man there's a lot of characters that stun superman opens with stuns usually with his basic spectre can stun multiple people dark side's basic there's a lot of stuns now in the game even King Sajam had one, even Bizarro, a lot of people. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. And then what I would do for the second one, it would it would be this actually for males, because there's a lot more males, and that's guaranteed 50% damage. Whereas here, you might use this three, but if the opponent doesn't have shield or awareness, it just it's a useless legendary point. But I would take this as a second, this as a third. Then I think, I think this has a fourth and fifth. So literally, you take them from below to the basic. So five is one for me. Two is or four is two. Three is three. Two is four, and one is five. That's literally what we're taking. Just just go like that. Five, four, three, two, one. That's literally what I'm gonna do. And you guys should farm her too because she has a very very good kit, man. She's gonna, gonna get used a lot, along with Mongol, I'm sure. Because that sun immunity is very strong, and then this three, it does so much damage. It can destroy the Spectres, like, very, very good. She's gonna, she's gonna kill the Spectre a lot. But yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video, and we actually have a Discord server where you can click the link below and join it. We have a channel for these Legends and MCC, by the way. But yeah, we have a channel for these Legends, we can chat about... DC Legends and stuff. And yeah, you can also get notified when I'm streaming or when I'm uploading a video. So you guys, you can do that if you want to and hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.